The woman accused of shooting and killing her terminally ill husband as part of a murder-suicide pact has now been officially charged, but not with first-degree murder. A grand jury indicted 76-year-old Ellen Gillant today. Police say she shot her husband, Jerry, at Advent Health Hospital in Daytona Beach last month before getting into a standoff with officers. News 6's Molly Reed has the latest on this case. 76-year-old Ellen Gillen now faces a lesser charge in the murder of her husband, Jerry. The state attorney's office presented its case to a Volusia grand jury this morning. The indictment shows now, instead of first-degree murder, she's charged with assisting in self-murder, which is considered manslaughter. It shows the grand jury found Gillen to have assisted Jerry in self-murder and kill him with a firearm. She's also charged with two counts of aggravated assault for threatening and pointing a firearm at two people and aggravated assault of an officer for doing this same to him. Now, just two weeks ago, a judge denied Gillen bond, but on this new charge, she will have a first appearance tomorrow, and that judge could allow her to bond out. Daytona Beach police say on January 21st, Gillen shot and killed her terminally ill husband, Jerry, in his hospital room. Investigators say she admitted it was part of a murder-suicide pact the couple had planned, but after shooting Jerry, she couldn't pull the trigger on herself. Detectives say Gillen wouldn't come out of the hospital room once police surrounded it. They say she also turned the gun on a nurse, security, and police, even firing around when the SWAT team entered the room. Gillen has been in jail now for over a month. Two weeks ago, a judge denied her bond. We heard from Gillen's family at the time who say the whole family, including Jerry's brother, supports her. He knew the, about the suffering, so her whole family is supportive and loving. In Volusia County, I'm Molly Reed getting results, News 6.